Hey guys, welcome back to Valkyria Chronicles. Last time we started the Marbury Shore battle, and now we're through the first phase, so we shall see what the enemy does. They will do nothing! Awesome. So, the smoke screen goes away after one turn. So, that's not good. First thing I would do is check where your units are and then see who's being targeted by a gun. I already know that Rosie is past the wall and she's only being targeted by one gun. So I'm just going to select her just to get her up further. That way I'm not going to be rolling over her with the tank. There you go. See, uh, if you want to move your units first, that's how you're going to want to do it. Screw you! Suck it! Flames are bitch! That was not really worth doing. I don't care. Ow, 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 This ain't even fair. Yeah, it's not. See, now he's behind cover and I'm behind cover, bitch. So, uh, this is one of those Gatling bunkers. As you can see, they're quite hefty. Uh, 2,000 HP. Uh, they got a medium tank right here, which is bad because it's looking right at Rosie, and I was not aware of that. I didn't know it could see Rosie from there. Uh, so they have a crouching shock trooper here, and another crouching shock trooper there. This one is crouching as well, and uh, we're going to be seeing our first of a certain enemy type here. here we go. So keep an eye out for it. So, okay. This is why you want to move the tank first, because they will shoot at the tank, but they won't shoot at the infantry while you're moving the tank, obviously. So then just go ahead and turn around and put up another smoke screen. Uh, I guess I'll just put it there. Uh, it doesn't do any damage, so you don't need to worry about hitting your guys with it, so I'll just put it right there, I guess. Put it right there. Poof! There you go. So that's really where you want to put it. You want to put it in the middle. You don't want to, um... A mistake you could potentially make is, um... Putting the smoke screen in directly in front of a gun because you know that's kind of what you would do you know you would well I guess I don't know because honestly that's what I did maybe I'm just an idiot but I actually tried putting the smoke screen like <clears throat> like right in front of one of the guns and that didn't work out so well so you wouldn't what you want to do is you want to smoke screen the area you're trying to move through that's about it I've been waiting here. Yeah, I know. So, we got a medium tank here. Um, I want to see if I can get Largo over here to help. Ow, ow. What the hell? He can hit me from there? Bastard. And did a lot of damage, too, for his range. Uh, That's not good. Well, I got plenty of CP, so... We'll see how we'll see what happens. Um, let's go ahead and get Vice up. He's not as close as Rosie, but maybe he can help with this uh, trooper over here. There we go. Good. Now, uh, something that's worth noting: if you throw a grenade like this, they will actually take less damage, even though it breaks through their cover, just because you're hitting them through the cover. You know what I mean? If you're throwing a grenade to someone behind cover, you want to get it on the same side of the cover as them because it actually does absorb damage. I'll do my very best. I'll do my very best. Good, Lloyd Irving. You should always do your best. And fight for justice and stuff. I don't know. No. Stop hitting Vice. Stop hitting Vice. Okay. <laughs> Damn, Lloyd Irving, you're a good shot. <laughs> oh my god, that was awesome. Okay, so Lloyd Irving is still amazing. As we all knew, we all knew that Lloyd Irving is the greatest Tales hero that has ever been created. Ah, sorry. Couldn't, I couldn't see you. You're in smoke. What do you expect? Okay, so you cannot take tanks through that gateway right there. It actually has on a, the map, it has a little uh, no tank thingy. Who's who? Who's here to help who? 
We're here to kill bitches. <laughs> there we go. So, um, the Shamrock is... It's... It's another tank. So, that's good, but it is not as strong as the Edelweiss. It's not as strong, it's not as durable, but it can, it can move just as far, and it can provide cover just as well as the Edelweiss can. So... It is definitely useful, although it's not quite as good at what it does, as what the Aid of Vice does, you know what I mean? Okay, so move Catherine there. Okay. So, what do I... I'm gonna move the Edelweiss. Because I need to get the Edelweiss out here. So, uh, when you're moving your tanks up to this point, you're going to want to move them to about here, and in this direction, you want to have them facing this way, so that these guns don't shred your radiators. So, uh, what you can do is, from here, you kind of have a choice, although your first choice should obviously be killing this tank here, because you don't want to have to deal with that. Um, could I roll over there and probably can't see it, but let's see. Ah, oh, hang on. Back up just a little bit. Oh my god. Ah! Oh! <laughs> that would have been amazing if I hit the, uh, the radiator and killed it. Oh well. So, go ahead and put your, uh, Edelweiss around there. Um, I guess take a shot at the radiator if you want, but hey, that also saves me, because now, even if he tries to move, he can't move far enough to actually get to my radiator, because he has to get all the way behind me in order to hit it. Um, let me see. Oh, this is another thing you want to do. You want to bring Carl over to your tanks. Carl's use, or any engineer's use in this mission, is basically just to keep your tanks safe. That's it. And I guess I could go ahead and heal Largo. Why not? Because he took some damage. May as well heal him. There we go. No problem. So, uh, just keep Carl around here. Um, just to keep your tanks up. So, yeah. That's pretty much all you're going to want to do with your uh, engineer. If you brought one. You don't have to, but I would recommend it. Honestly, I would say bring an engineer on every mission, no matter what. So, yeah. No! <laughs> Are you kidding me? You didn't even reach... Oh my god. But yeah, this is the point where they've got elites, so they're defensive. They're hard to kill, which sucks. No, don't... Don't miss with your flamethrower. Did you miss? Oh no, I think you did like five damage to me. Whatever will I do? <laughs> God. Your flamethrowers suck. Come on. Ow. Okay, so the Gatling bunkers can be controlled like that, you know. Oh. Ow. Good thing Largo's in a pretty decent spot, all things considered. Don't crouch. Okay, good. <laughs> no, no. Don't. <laughs> really? You guys suck. Did you just get those? I think these guys just upgraded to flamethrowers, and they don't really know how far they go. Ow. Asshole. Dude, you didn't move. <laughs> these guys are idiots. Oh my god, this whole this episode is going to be named after these jackasses. My god. The title the title will make sense once I get to this once we get to this point or that point, whatever. Anyway, god, that was awesome. <laughs> okay, um uh, I want to kill that medium tank. I'm going to go ahead and see if I can kill this medium tank here. Enemy sighted. Fire. Damn it! Stop hitting the... Oh, it's because the gun is actually right up... A okay. 
I just need to actually start shooting the tank. Okay. Just watch this. So I'm a little bit. Uh, Out. Damn. Hurts. Oh, only three shots? Huh. Okay. I'll do it. You're done. Boom. Nice. Ow. See, now that's why you want to use these trenches here. These trenches are really good. And honestly, let me see. Oh, there's landmines here, so be careful. Um, it might seem stupid, but I would actually recommend um, getting in these positions where enemies can see you just so that you can crouch. Because when you're down here in this area, you know, you can't crouch. So you don't have the boosted defense. They can't see you, but they can still move down there. You know what I mean? Way ahead of you. So you don't want to uh, give them any opportunities to hit you. So from here... Ooh! Oh, come on, that'd be awesome. Ah, I wish he fired another anti-tank shell. That'd be badass. But okay, um... I would not recommend driving the shamrock up to where it was. Um, I would keep it in the back like this. Um, not because it's weak, it's just because if you do that, you don't have any room to move with the Edelweiss. So, yeah. Anyway, um, so, you know, I'm nervous about getting on this tower. But I'm going to do it anyway. Oh, nice. Do I detect a hit coming? <laughs> I do. Let's see. What can I hit? Oh, I can't hit those shock troopers over there. Bastards. Oh, here we go. Oh my god, look at that accuracy. Oh man. That's a thing of beauty. Um. Can I see? Oh! Can I see them? Oh, I can't. Crap. Well, I guess. Ah, there it is. The heavy tank. It's a dickhead. All right, I'll just go ahead and shoot this scout. Bang. Um, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna drop down for now. Cause that's all. I don't feel comfortable with my sniper staying up there in a tower. So I'll just take one shot and then come back down, so I'm safe. Uh, let's see here. They're all pretty weak. <sighs> Let's get Rosie. Ow! God! <laughs> that was a lot of bullets. Jeez. That was a lot of bullets, too. Ow! <laughs> God damn! <laughs> Rosie can take a beating! Ow, 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 ow. Oh, attack down. No. Yeehaw. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So I'm going to leave my shock troopers right there for now. Um, I'm going to come in with a scout, I think. Ramona, let's do it. All right, she's pretty accurate. Uh, I could get closer than this. Here, uh, Lloyd, I'm gonna hide behind you. Okay, good. <laughs> yeah, suck it. No more troopers. Yes. Or no more troopers here. This is actually, um, I know this is going pretty well, um, but this is actually a very long mission. We're gonna be here for a little bit. Um, Landmine right there, so be careful. Uh, Scout Elite there. I'm going to go ahead and get right back here. So that in the next turn I can take down this uh, Gatling thingy. Um, actually, you know what? I could just... You know what? Uh, I could get Alicia and just take it down myself. Um, heavy tank. Damn you. Hate you. Um, let's see. I haven't moved Alicia. I need to move Alicia. Can't have her be falling behind. I need to keep her. Can't beat the smell of fresh soil. Got to keep her up with the uh, other people, you know. So okay. Um. See now I'm nervous. This is gonna hit 
Ramona? I don't think it will. Guess we'll find out. Nope, it did not. <laughs> okay, so that's one Gatling barrier down. Or barrier, Gatling gun thingy, gun emplacement, whatever. Same difference. Okay, so from here I'm just going to take Alicia and put her... I'll put her with Largo, I guess. Why not? Think you can stop me? Yes. They think they can, but they can't. That's the thing. Go away, medium t What the hell? Your turret is on the back. How the hell did you even... Whatever. Um, see, now I'm a little... I'm going to move Ramona back because I think she's in danger now. Yes, she is. Oh, my God. Screw you, landmine. Okay. I'm going to take her... Can't stop the battering ram! What the hell? Is that what people call you? Or is that what people do to you at night? I'm on my way. Ugh. <laughs> Whatever. You knew that was going to come eventually. Anyway. Alright, Lloyd Irving. It's time to be badass again. You can do it. I believe! I, I knew it! Lloyd Irving is the greatest anti-tank lancer ever. Your your orders continue to be badass. Okay. Oh my god. Lloyd Irving is amazing. God. I'm getting so lucky with Hector. You are never getting a mortar, good sir. Never. You get to stick with a lance. Oh, now they're calling for reinforcements. The bitches! What, you need reinforcements? Oh, God. I forgot they can do that. Oh, no! I took one damage! <laughs> At least it didn't hit Alicia. That could have been that. That actually could have been bad if it hit Alicia. But yeah, they have grenade launchers, too. So that's bad. That's pretty bad. Um, so from here, you can do good stuff with your tanks. Uh, first thing, I'm moving the Shamrock. Way ahead of you. Now, um, let me see. Okay, the heavy tank is not in range to see me, so I don't need to worry about it. So, what you're going to want to do is take your tanks and drive them to about here. And from here, uh, you can go ahead and mess around with these units over here. You can get a little uh, preemptive on their asses. Uh, as you can see, there's a camp right here you can take care of. And over there, uh, hang on, over there we have more invulnerable guns. There's another one here that you just can't see. Um, so, you want to position the Edelweiss there, so it's in a good range to lay down more smoke rounds around there. That's where you want to put the smoke rounds this time around. You want to put them on that uh, tank trap. But for now, um, I'm not going to bother with that. I'm going to go ahead and go for this uh, Trooper Elite. So, yeah. Because anything to take away their, uh, what's it called? You know, their CP. And anything to destroy those tank traps to make it easier for my units to get through. Um, and of course I'm going to move the Edelweiss too. And at this point, you can actually save a lot of CP because you don't really need to move your tanks so much anymore. Because, you know, they're just not doing as much now. Okay, so I'm going to kill that guy. Boom. So yeah, uh, Zaka kind of has like a standard issue Gallian tank, whereas the Edelweiss, as we already know, uh, you know, it's more unique. But okay. Um, that's what I'm going to be doing with my tanks, and of course you can always just turn around and lay mortar fire over here if you want, but I'm not going to be doing that. Um, don't really need to get Carl to heal the Edelweiss because it's doing fine, so I'm going to leave him there. Um, shock troopers, let's do it. Leave it all to me. Time to kill us some scouts. Hi, how you doing? Not so good no more. Ooh! Suck it. Ow, 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 ow! Oh my god! Whew! <laughs> oh my god, he took a lot of damage. Oh, vice. Okay. Um, here, let's do this. I'm going to get Catherine. Leave the back up to me. 
Aw, oh, no uh, potential. Okay. Um. Okay, it doesn't matter. I can still hit them just fine. Uh, I'm gonna go for this shock trooper here. Oh, what the hell? Oh, come on. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, I'm about halfway done with this turn, so tune in next time to see what happens next. Hopefully Vice won't get his ass raped. So see you then.